enhanced uv radiation due to climate change on polymer products ozone layer depletion effect every day uv radiations encompassing wavelength from 100 to 400 nanometers presents a critical component of solar energy incident on earth surface powering life shaping weather and silently transforming the world around us but as our climate changes so does the behavior of electromagnetic rays moreover increasing uv radiation contributes to the photochemical degradation of natural and synthetic material including polymers thereby releasing additional greenhouse gases here are the range of electromagnetic radiations emitted by the sun the three wavelength ranges along the solar radiation spectrum that are relevant for their impact on skin and their impact goes beyond sunburn high above us a gas called ozone surrounds the planet the ozone layer acts as a barrier between earth and uv rays from the sun however pollution has changed the ozone layer to thin exposing life on earth to dangerous radiations earth atmosphere is made up of six layers the second layer called stratosphere contains the ozone layer ozone layer is made up of highly reactive molecule called ozone which contains three oxygen atom it is a trace gas in the atmosphere the ozone layer acts as earth sunscreen absorbing about 98% of damaging uv rays chemicals like chlorofluorocarbons or cfcs are primarily culprit in ozone layer breakdown they are mostly generated from refrigerants aerosols and plastic products when they are exposed to uv rays in the atmosphere they break down in substances that includes chlorine chlorine react with oxygen atom in o3 and breaks apart the ozone molecule here is the graph showing increasing solar radiations over years and the global map comparison of uv radiation intensities across the world over time polymers degrade meaning their structure background under environmental factors like uv radiation especially uvb mechanical stress heat and moisture which leads the plastic cracking becoming more brittle and fragmenting into micro and nano plastics these methods are crucial in extending the service life of polymer products exposed to sunlight in conclusion we can say climate change is a global change that requires collective action by raising awareness and adopting sustainable measures we can protect the planet for future generations